All right, we're live. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the stream tonight. This is Impulse, and I'm on the SMB server. I'm all by myself right now, waiting for my buddies to get on, and I'm sure they will will be on shortly. You know how it is, holiday season, everybody's got a lot going on. And you may notice things look a little bit different right now than usual. I'm running a texture pack today. Uh, I forgot the name of the texture pack. What is it? Um, R3D Craft or something like that. Um, it's a 256. And uh, we'll see how, how the machine runs with the 256. Look at that. Things look good, though. I like the wood. I like the look of it. It looks, it looks nice. And I got a little bit of music playing. You guys will see that scrolling across the top. Uh, sounds like it's a little bit low right now. I'm gonna turn up the volume on that just a bit. Mm. All right, we'll see if you guys can hear that. Make sure I got my uh, Twitch settings going here. Enable when streaming. I'm not actually using the in-game Twitch. I'm using Open Broadcaster, but if I have, ooh, enable always. That's what I need. That way, if you guys chat to me, I'll see it. There we go. There we go. <laughs> we are live. What's up, Zap? Glad you could join us this time. What? Us? It's just me right now. <laughs> Other guys are running a little bit late. How you doing, man? <laughs> this guy's been trying to get at me for like an hour. <laughs> just been hanging out, chilling. AFK in a bit here. My new farm. Got some work to do. Just trying to let the grass spread here. How's the uh, how's the sound for you, Zap? Does it sound okay? Music mix with the voice and the game sounds, all that good stuff. User joined your channel. Ooh, all right. Oh, hey, McBean. You watching Whoa. this game? <laughs> no, man. I'm streaming. <laughs> All right, I'll it's tell you, good, I'm going to be on about game. two minutes because we might have a playoff game next week. Yeah, no, it's looking good. Trying to keep track of both right now. <laughs> music is loud. Yeah, turn it down. Just right-click on the music bot, and you can change the volume, bring it down. All right, I'll be on about uh, probably five minutes or so. Cool, there you go. All right. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so uh, we, got a, we got a game going on here. Football game, NFL. <laughs> And it's a big game for well, look at that big slime. It's a big game for my home team, the Cardinals, because we need we need San Francisco to lose tonight. <laughs> and the game is close. I almost had to delay the stream to watch it, but you know what? I'm here. I got my eye on the score. It's a close game. Right now it's 24-27. And uh, let's see who's got the ball. Looks like looks like San Fran's probably getting the ball. Anyway, anyway, we're here streaming though. <laughs> cool thanks for the sound check zap appreciate that so tonight my plan is to build up the more of this uh, pumpkin farm i started down here and also got a melon farm over here i'll go down and take care of that slime <laughs> hopefully once i get it all built up there won't really be anywhere for those guys to spawn and uh <laughs> everybody's texting me about this game this football game because it's going crazy at the last minute, of course, as soon as I jump on the live stream. Alright. So you can kind of hear the music. It'll uh, it'll fade down when I talk and, and when others talk. And then as soon as I stop talking, you should hear it kick up a little bit. So if there's a uh, quiet in the channel, then you get to hear the music a little better. So that should be cool. Hopefully that works out well. All right, let's go down to the bottom of this farm and show you guys what's going on here. It's a tight squeeze in here. This new texture pack is going to take me a while to get used to. <laughs> Everything just looks absolutely nuts. But uh, I may do it from time to time, switch up the texture pack, just see what I like. I do like the glass look, though. That's pretty neat. Like I said... <laughs> oh, yeah, uploading a video. Yeah, yeah, I bet. I bet. Ooh, look at that slime trying to get down to me. Alrighty, I'm back. Uh oh, is that, is that a bad sign? Does that mean they couldn't Pick make six. it happen? It's a bad thing. Oh man. Ah, oh, depressing. Yeah. <laughs> whoa, whoa. He tried. 
He kamikaze me, man. See that? What's up, crazy one miner? Nice to see you, man. Thanks for joining us tonight. DevTech, how you doing, brother? We got McBean on, getting logged in just now. I'm going to be working on these farms here. Just wanted to come down and see where I was at, get reminded of all the supplies I was going to need. So I need some iron blocks, I need some dirt, I need some pumpkin seeds. There's McBean joining the game. And we should be getting, uh, let's see, I got a timer that should go off. Every once in a while that will tell you what texture pack I'm running. Let me see if I can force it to go off right now. Uh, don't know how to do that. That's okay. It'll go off in every 10 minutes or so. What'd you do? Upgrade your texture pack? Uh, yeah, I got a different texture pack. I'm running just for just for tonight. See if I like it. It's different. <laughs> yeah, it's, if you're used to something, texture packs will do that for you. Yeah, it'll take me a while. Cool. Well, thanks for joining. Glad you saw that YouTube video. Hopefully that helps everybody get the word out a little better, get some more people on the stream with us, hanging out. Going to be here for a while tonight. I plan on going for about, I don't know, three or four hours, hopefully. And uh, got some farms to build up. This thing is going to be nuts when we're done. So I just need to go gather some supplies, and we'll be building it up here shortly. <laughs> I'm heading over there right now. Uh, yeah, you should come come to the uh, sugarcane farm. See the work I've done over the past few days. We worked on a little bit last week in the live stream and didn't quite get to the top. I think I had about three or four more layers to go and uh, finished all those afterwards off camera and then put a little more decoration into it. And it's turned off right now. That's why you see all the sugarcane all grown up. I got it turned off because, uh, <laughs> look at that guy. Yeah, because uh, my chests were overloading, so I didn't want to overfill <laughs> this system. <laughs> What's he doing down there? Oh, that slime? He's just hanging out. Hanging out, huh? Yeah, he spawned on top of it, and then he, then he jumped down to try to get me. <laughs> nice. He didn't get me. He didn't. Nice. You got the glass on top of it now. Yeah. You got the sidewalls done. What is that? Some clay blocks there? Yeah, I got some yellow stained clay. Make it look nice. Yeah, now I just need to build up these middle farms, and I think it's going to look really great. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know if Tango... Uh, he's not in game, I'll tell you that, but I don't know if he's going to be joining us. Have you been busy lately that you haven't been posting any vids to YouTube? Yes, yes, I've been I've been busy. I did post a vlog trying to explain working on a uh, pretty big project. has been taking all my time up pretty much other than the, the SMB nights. And... Uh, it's going to be nice. It's going to be nice once we get that project done. And I think you guys will be pretty pretty excited when you see it. So Try not to give too much away. <laughs> oh, How do you even get balls. down there now? Oh, right there by the door. Yeah, there's a ladder right by the door you can get down. I see it. So I need to get I need to get more supplies though. What do you need? Um, I'm going to need pistons. I'm just about out of wood for that. I gotta get reacquainted with how all these items look in the game with this texture pack. Did you uh, expand out your uh, your building here? Uh, no, I'm actually destroying it. It's going to okay. oh, it's gonna come see. down. Oh, yeah, okay. I gotta take down this whole building. I'm gonna redo all the storage inside here because um, right now there's only two chests and a hopper really to keep everything in. And I think I'm gonna go for some uh, silos. You know, some vertical silos in here. Okay. <laughs> Hello, Swaggy Marv. How's it going? Thanks for joining the stream tonight. We're going to be on for a while. Should be a fun Swaggy one. Swaggy Marv. What a name. I like it. Yeah. Uh, let's see. What do I need? I am working. I'm going to work on the pumpkins first. I think those are... I think we need pumpkins probably more than we need melons. Not a, not a big watermelon eater. We got plenty of pumpkins. What are you talking about? I mean on this farm. I know, I know Fallen's got his farm, but... Yep. I guess it really hey, have doesn't you, matter. Have you been over to my build yet? No, you know, I was going to kind of wait, you know, until some part in the stream when you say, hey, it's in a good spot to show off. Well, it's, it's, it's a work in progress, but it's getting there. And uh, I've got, I'm working on the, f the front facade right now. I got a little bit of the sides done. 
I'm still trying to figure out some of the corners and how I'm going to do the corners because I just don't like the way they look yet. But tonight we're going to have to take a look over there. Yeah. Ooh, 5.30 in the morning for somebody. Did you get Must up that early or are you UK, staying man. up? <laughs> man. Yeah, R3D uh, 256 is what I'm, what I'm rolling with. Let's take a look at this stream. I want to see what your texture pack looks like. Yeah, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. Yeah, I'm old school vanilla all the way. Nice and smooth, though. Yeah, yeah. I love the uh, the look of these half slabs. They just look brilliant. I like the way just that what you're on right now, the uh, the piston. Very oh, nice yeah. and smooth looking. Yeah, and the wood here, too. I'll give you a look at the wood if you're looking at the stream. Is that wood or is that dirt? Oh, I was oh, looking. Yeah, you're right. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, it's, you got the delay, but the... I got the delay. Yep, I see what you're talking about. Yep, the slab. Wow, those slabs do look nice. Yeah. What's the glass plane? Okay, nice and smooth. Hong Kong. Wow. Welcome from Hong Kong. That's awesome. Wow. That's a far away ways. Not to him, it's not. <laughs> Ooh, man, my, look, I like the way I look too in your texture pack. I like the way the armor looks. Yep. Looking sweet. Stylish, man. So now that you look good in my texture pack, maybe you wear armor from now on. You know what? Forget <laughs> that. I'm taking it off. Oh, geez. I'm not going to watch you undress, man. Oh, man. I can't. I got too much crap. <laughs> oh. Man, look at that. That armor does look good, though. Yeah, I've never been a big texture pack fan. It's just, uh, I felt like changing it up. Sometimes I gotta do that, you know, just to keep the game fresh. I gotta change things up every once in a while, and I usually end up hating stuff and then just switching back, but... Ooh, awesome. Stream is, stream is smooth and good. That's, that's good. Smooth and good? Did I just say smooth? International. <laughs> I... Okay, so Need tell me about blocks. this because I, you know me, I'm not, I'm not a redstone person at all. So over here, this is going to be the pumpkin side, right? Yep. Yep. And then the other side is going to be watermelon. And apparently, slime. And slime. <laughs> yeah, I see that. <laughs> oh man. Oh, I know what it is. It's all those hoppers. I bet you they're going to spawn on those hoppers. Hey, what's up, JJ Rocket? How's it going? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna build these all the way up, just all the way up to the glass, just like I got the uh, the sugar cane coming. So, but those uh, they'll, they'll be those. They should be covered though, right? Aren't they? As we build it up. Which ones? You said the hoppers. Is that what? Uh, yeah. Well, there's there's some hoppers in the middle there. Oh, I see. Yeah, you're right. It's like a perfect size for a big one too, huh? I'm not even gonna try to pronounce your name. R L V A T D one. Hello. How's it going? Thanks for joining. <laughs> Real that D1. Real that D1. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Oh, uh, McBean, are you streaming tonight? Do we need to set up a... Uh... Uh, I, I, no, I'm not. No. It's, uh, my <laughs> yeah. streams aren't as smooth as yours. you got this, okay. you know, high-speed internet connection. I'm like on a dial-up. That's what it feels like sometimes. <laughs> you know what I think it is? I got... Man, I my computer's doing really well with the streaming thing. Just a beast of a computer, so... For me, it is 9.45 p.m. A little bit past his bedtime. Yeah. Okay, okay. Um, what do I need? I said I needed some iron. You know what? I'm just going to get to business. Oh, okay, cool. So you just, yeah, you spell it out. That's good. <laughs> I'm going to get to building. And then McBean... Tell me when to come over to your place. Yep, I'm gonna I wanna, back over there right now. I wanna now. make sure it's in a good shape when I get over there. Oh, it's in a good shape. It's just not the shape, the final shape. All right, cool. Cool, cool. All right, well, I'm gonna build up a couple layers here. I'm, I don't think these layers are gonna take me as long as it did uh, for the sugar cane part. I think these ones will be fairly easy to do. <laughs> Everything just looks so different. It's gonna be tripping me out all night long. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, did I just break redstone? Uh-oh. Was that server lag? <laughs> 11.45. Is that AM, PM? What are we dealing with there? I'll totally just destroy that redstone. Get back in there. I am in Arizona. Oh, suffering in the cold weather. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, it's freezing today, right? <laughs> 60 <laughs> degrees, I think. 
Uh, no, I've never played UHC. You know, not officially with like a you know a bunch of people. I... You had a bad day. You take the wood down. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I had the uh, the NFL game on and it just popped a commercial in like super loud. Everybody's ears are hurting. <laughs> Pretty soon they're gonna be complaining. No. <laughs> I think that game's officially over, right, McBean? Oh, I think it is. I like I said, they. You know what? It, so they scored a touchdown. They got the. They got a. They got the onside kick on like the 30 yard line and the first pass it was bobbled and the guy caught it and ran it back. No. Oh, no. depressing. All right, well, I got to check on my fantasy team real quick. I got to check on my fantasy team cuz we're in the championship. Well, you're in the finals, right? Championship, championship right, yeah. game and this if this game is over, is it over? Should be. Hasn't updated. My, my phone needs winning? to update. I was winning. Yeah, yep. That's I was excellent. I was winning the game, and I needed I needed the kicker, their kicker, the Falcons kicker, to not get 13 points. That's what I needed. Well, let's see. They I, had I think they probably finished the game with I don't know what was the final score. I'll tell you. Yeah, I'm looking. I'm looking. Final right. score was 24. So they scored three touchdowns and a field goal. That's well, depending on the distance. I think you should be safe. Yep. 117 to 111, my fantasy team wins, and that's money in my pocket. That's money. That's money. All right. Impulse is buying <laughs> drinks for everybody. I'll take a doctor. Pepper. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's get to building. What do you say? I'm a little happier now. I mean, I'm very sad that the, the I wanted the 49ers to lose so that the Cardinals had a chance, of course. Hey, I heard we still have a chance. Uh, this this server I'm on is a whitelisted server, so it's it's a private server that the SMB crew plays on. So I'm not gonna be giving out the IP, and even if I did, you wouldn't be able to get on it. So I have heard that if New Orleans loses their game next week, mm -hmm. we will be in the playoffs. Uh, I think we well, I mean we gotta beat we gotta beat San Francisco. Next week Still as have to well. Beat San Francisco, that's yeah. true, but that's that's doable. The rest is true. True story. That's the same thing I heard. So that's nice. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Uh, I'm trying to keep up with the chat. Okay, what's the texture pack? It is R, uh, 3D craft, I believe. Um, yeah, it's going to take me a while. Streaming. Yeah, I <laughs> I have a timer that's supposed to go off and tell everybody every once in a while. And for some reason, the timers, they you can't do them like more than every 10 minutes. So oh. uh, at some point here, it should go off and let everybody know. Let's see. Um, so we got pistons like this. Try to build this thing here. <laughs> what is that? Dot. Yeah, dot 1.1. One, yeah, that's it. Yeah, Naked and Scared. So that Naked and Scared, somebody was asking me about UHC. That's kind of like a UHC. I mean, we play with the natural regeneration off, um, but it's just me and me and uh, Skizzle Man trying to <laughs> trying to survive a certain challenge, whatever the challenge is that we lay out or randomly pick from a dispenser. It's pretty cool. We didn't make it last time. Thank you for introducing me to CMA. Yes, CMA. I, I got him in the, the playlist as well. And CMA is, if you like kind of chill dubstep or chill step, uh, great artist for that. Found him on SoundCloud, I think. <laughs> that IP is wrong. Oh, I should have grabbed more pumpkin seeds. Dang. Dang. Here, let me do something for that might help with all the uh, the people asking about the texture pack. I'm going to set something up real quick. Let me see if I can do this. Mm, let me just set up some sort of custom command here that might help. Um, I'm going to add a new command. And we're going to say TP as in texture pack. And boom. So basically now, if you want to know what the texture pack is, in Twitch, all you should have to do is do an exclamation point, TP, 
And let's see. There it is. Sweet. All right, all right. Sweet. That worked. We are definitely going to do another season of Naked and Scared. Um, just waiting on the right time for, for Schizoman and I to get together. You know, with the big project I've been working on, it's literally, literally been no time. <laughs> Come on, give us a clue about it. You say big, is, I, I don't even know what it is. I mean, is it a, <laughs> truly a big project? It's, or is that giving away too much? It's, yeah, I can't give away too much. But it, it's definitely going to be a game changer for, for my channel. I'll say that. Okay. Uh, that's that's all I'm gonna say. Game changer for your channel. All right, people, start guessing because I don't know either what it is. <laughs> Game changer. Q and A. Q and A. Yeah, Q and A. Get them going. All right, Kondrick is here. Awesome. Hey, welcome, Kondrick. <laughs> Returns to lurking. <laughs> yeah, that means I also got a uh, a moderator. Yay. Yeah, 256, and we'll see if the, uh, the the old computer can handle it. <laughs> all right, grab all these pumpkins here. I need some seeds. Oh, is that texture pack 256? Yeah. Yep. Very nice. I used to use, uh, well, I usually use the Faithful 32, which I really like. I'm not saying I'm going to go away from it forever or anything like that. <laughs> no, I'm wearing clothes. <laughs> Thank goodness. Just in case I accidentally turn the webcam on. <laughs> <laughs> I am, how old am I right now? 32. I started YouTube uh, just, you know, watching some of the guys that inspired me was Doc M, B00, Etho, of course, when I first started out. And uh, basically, when, you know, me and my buddies, we had the original SMB server, we were creating some cool farms and stuff, and I decided it'd be. A good idea to post one, and then sure enough, Doc M got to see it and liked it, and from there the channel grew. We've been going ever since, so kind of kind of owe Doc M for giving me the first shout out. Uh, I guess I could have brought. <laughs> Sweet. Do I have, are you asking me? I, I think he's asking me if I have a girl. Yeah, I actually have a wife. I have a wife and three kids. R3D64 on top of, you know, I do have, I have them both. I have Faithful 32, so this is R3D on top of Faithful 32 in case, uh, you know, in case there's anything I missed or whatever. Um, SMB. <laughs> what does SMB stand for? I'm not going to let McBean answer because we have... We have kind of two answers to that. <laughs> for, I it stands for, for. For the stream, to keep things PG, kid-friendly, it is Super Minecraft Brothers. Enough said. Exactly. That's Nuff exactly said. it. <laughs> it used to be something different when we were we were lean and mean first-person shooter guys, and uh, you know now we're <laughs> now we're cool, <laughs> cool, calm, and collected Minecraft players. So. Who is Blue Cheetah? That's a good question. Yeah, Blue Ooh, Cheetah was in the, some of the early episodes of Future Craft, and then I did too much redstone, and he didn't. <laughs> he don't want to join me anymore. Uh, Blue Cheetah is actually my son. He's nine years old right now, and when we started doing Future Craft, I think he was probably uh, almost eight, maybe even seven. Hey, when he does that stuff, Impulse, does he, is he using his uh, real voice? Or are you still doing the uh, the machine? No, uh, he hasn't done it for a while, actually. Uh, cause, That's true. He's been yeah. retired. He's yeah, living he, a good life. I he guess. he left he left the Future Craft series because he was bored of watching me doing uh, Redstone. <laughs> Twerk for Twinkies, nice name. How's it going? <laughs> Sweet. Yeah. Love Twinkies. <laughs> so glad to see them come back. Yeah, that was a scary time, right? Was. Thought they were gonna be gone forever. People were like hoarding Twinkies and stuff. No. <laughs> yeah. uh, Minecraft P. No, I have not. No. I haven't got a chance to, to check that out. Blue Cheetah is trying to get me to get the uh, PlayStation 3 version of Minecraft now that that just came out. So I may have to do it. 
You know, that's funny. I mean, what's I the difference, right? If he's got a computer to play, I mean... It's just, just I, I don't know, for just the, the luxury of being able to sit on the couch and play with a joystick? I, I, don't, I have no idea what his interest is, but... I thought it might be cool just to just to see it, just to see what's different than the PC. Because sometimes, you know, with Xbox, I get a lot of questions when I invent things. Does this work on Xbox? And it would be kind of nice to know, you know, if... Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, you know, I could go check it out on the PlayStation and say, you know what, no. I mean, if people are asking me about it, this does or does not work. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I try to turn vanilla Minecraft into a Feed the Beast type of game, I don't know. No, I am, I'm not into, into mods, and I've said it for a long time, I really, I don't know if I ever will be. You know, it, I'd really have to get bored of vanilla, and that's, that hasn't happened in over, I don't know, a year and a half now that I've been playing. Which actually isn't long, considering the history of Minecraft. <laughs> I get that a lot. A lot of people don't know I'm as old as I am. I guess I talk. I talk old. young. Do I talk old young? Man. <laughs> That's good. I, young at heart, man. Definitely. Oh, yep. I didn't see the first time. You know what? I'll give you a chance, Noek. I'll give you a chance. You can be a mod. I only got one other mod in the stream right now. I could use another one. I will hook you up. But that's all I'm gonna that's all I'm gonna take for now. So there you go. Help me out and you can stay a mod. Uh I believe PS3 is also impulse SV. I've pretty much branded that everywhere. But I don't, I don't play on the PS3 a lot, actually. I just... Hey, for the people that don't know, where does Impulse SV come from? Hmm, that's a good question. So the Impulse part actually comes from a uh, drum corps that I was on. A professional drum corps here in the United States. And I played snare drum on a, on a drum line for the drum corps. We toured around the, uh, the U.S. And, you know, after that, of course, I kind of... Just kept that, kept that with me, you know. And then the SV is actually my initials. So now people will start trying to guess what my name is. <laughs> His first name is Silly. Silly. <laughs> well, if you ask, uh, <laughs> if you ask Skizzle Man, it will be stupid. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So, no, I don't have an Xbox, and I've actually never had an Xbox. I thought about getting the Xbox One, uh, but and I just realized that I don't know if I'll ever really play consoles that much. Just, at least not now. I got so much going on with, with Minecraft, and uh, I just, I don't have time. You know, with the being full-time job and the, the big family I got, just don't have time to do much else other than do the family gig, do the work gig, and, and play as much Minecraft as I can fit in. Alright, I got a couple questions I gotta I gotta answer here. The first one, Zip Crowd Crew, yeah, I've been been quiet. I've been quiet with Zip Crowd too ever since the uh, ever since we got back from Minecon, been busy with the project I talked about and and haven't been on Zip Crowd much. I know those guys are, are working on rebuilding the storage room, they're working on some big projects. Um, as most of you probably saw the the spawner situation trying to get spawners to spawn they've been still working on that trying to get the perfect spot in the zip crowd server to to get some multiple spawners together so there's that um what version did i start playing the game i don't know mcbean you remember we started around the same time i think it was well, you know i have some screenshots of when i first started playing i would love to take a look it was during one of the betas but i, I don't remember specifically which version yeah yeah me either i, I remember 1.2.4 but i think that was not my first version i think it was a, it was one or two versions before that so whoa look at all these guys hello Kondrick. hey thanks for your service there in the air force buddy i was in the army so uh thanks Nice, nice. Oh, and somebody asked what my what is my occupation? I am a software developer. 
Okay. Not what that means either for those of you that don't know, <laughs> I don't know what the heck that means. Uh, yeah, yeah. I develop all sorts of software that people use to make their lives better. <laughs> we'll stick with that. Ooh, I'm in the hopper. Can I get out of here? Uh, we got a whitelisted server here, so the IP is not gonna not gonna help. It's a private one. Um, I gotta go get some more pistons. Need some pistons. Da, da, da. I might have to go cut down some trees. <laughs> That'll be well, fun. If you're gonna cut down trees, you can do that over here because I'm gonna need a couple trees cut down. See? It's one okay. of the tasks I have to do eventually. I'll head over there and take a quick tour, see where you're at. All right. Sounds good. Let's see. Lots Bryce M. Yeah, he wanted me to say his name. Looks like uh, control systems for Notch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> SV stands for Bill Gates. Kendrick, I wouldn't doubt it. Uh, my PC specs. Hmm. You know, I don't know them offhand. I, I know I'm running the, the GTX 580 uh, video card. I usually have two of them. I just took one out just because I thought it was causing problems having them in Sly. Um, I could check real quick, I guess. Let me look. Uh, if I go to my settings here, give me a second. And no, wrong thing. I think he's got a. Quad 386, four megs of RAM. <laughs> I'm, I'm checking my system properties here. I got an i7 3960X. I'm running it at the stock speed, 3.3 gigahertz. 24 uh, gig of RAM in here, and then like I said, I got the I got, <laughs> I got the uh, GTX 580. All right, I am heading over McBean. I make sure I got my my chopper. Uh, what else do I need? I'm gonna be making pistons. So uh, you know what? I'm just gonna get the wood and bring it back here and craft everything when I get back. That's the the idea. I might need to grab some more food while I'm at it. Oh, trapdoors look nice too. So if you guys are wondering, the text scrolling across the top there—that's actually the artist and track, and then there's a number in front of it, which is the order. Uh, number it's in in the playlist so we kind of have an idea of how many songs we've burned through as we go whoa 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 whoa! I got started on redstone pretty much right off the bat I mean being kind of a software engineer I like the idea of engineering things in the game and farming you know was the big my big thing you know obviously I started with mob farming you know watching etho videos things like that so if, uh, automation always intrigued me. Ooh, look at this. Oh yeah, I can see this thing coming together already. The stained glass is looking awesome, McBean. Yeah, so yeah, you like that front facade there? Yeah, I like it. Looks good. Yeah, so uh, this is kind of the entrance to the uh, soon-to-be cathedral. Not sure, like I said, about the side, the far left and far right, what I'm going to do with those towers. Or even how I'm gonna finish these black and white ones. Take a look in the stream, real quick, so you can see what oh, it looks yeah, like right. in, my, uh, in my texture there. pack. I'll leave it here just for a second. No, I got it. It's, I can see it. It's uh, it looks like stained glass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but come inside though, you'll see what I'm doing with the side walls here. We're gonna accent it with a little bit of uh, lapis. And so the side walls, I'm gonna have kind of a checkered pattern. I've got uh, the blue. I love the blue stained glass, by the way. Is this white wool on the ground? This is white wool, absolutely. Okay. Yes, <laughs> that's how I can get the lighting in here right now for the time being. Ooh. So yeah, uh, got the the, uh, the side walls up, at least the initial side walls there. That's cool. cool. And then straight behind you here, this is going to be another kind of tower that goes up, but this area of this block is going to be gone. And this wall right here is going to be stained glass, and you'll be able to see the sunset right over those trees that you're going to cut down for me. Ah, oh, nice. Okay. So you need these yeah. ones cut down. Those are the ones that I need to cut down. Someone was just asking me in the stream if I would recommend an AMD processor. What do you think about that, McBean? I don't think you would recommend an AMD I, processor. I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't. You know, I don't know. Personally, just... I wouldn't. Now, I might recommend an AMD video card. Uh oh Oh, shut the tree. <laughs> Pro. But probably not a processor. I used to have a I used to have a, a AMD video card. Let, um, let me tell you. And I just switched uh, actually. I had a 
a little older than Impulse. Um, back when I was in the army, back in the day. <laughs> back in my day. Exactly. <laughs> I had uh, I had an AMD. Well, first off, I upgraded my Pentium 75 system, and I upgraded it to an AMD K6 200. So it was 200 megahertz, uh, and it was the, the basically their processor to deal with Intel's Pentium processors. Um, I was so excited to get that processor, though. <laughs> of course, that was a very long time ago. <laughs> and where is it now? <laughs> you know what? I still have it. Do you I really? You just hung on to it for you know nostalgia? The... Yeah, I do. I collect uh, old CPUs, though. So I have, like, almost all of the, uh, I mean, 286s, 386s, 486s. And then it got really expensive, and uh, I've got all of the original Pentium line, but then it got, like I said, just too expensive to get that stuff. <laughs> Didn't say it was bad, just it w said I wouldn't recommend an AMD processor. <laughs> I have my reasons. Actually, I think uh, my processor actually has six cores, and then they're hyper-threaded or whatever, so that would make it, you know, like 12 virtual, I guess you'd say, right? But I don't overclock it, I just, you know, my PC is already kind of a, kind of a space eater, so I don't, I don't want to make it any hotter. Uh, somebody asked, who's Skizzle Man to me? Skizzle Man is my very, very close friend, best friend for many, many years, let's see. Uh, I'm 32 now. He's been my best friend since I was like 15. So, yeah, you do the math there. He's been my best friend for a long time. We've worked at many different jobs together. He actually sits three cubicles down from me. I think three. Two or three down from me right now at, at my job. So we work together still and spend a lot of way too much time together. We know each other way too well. He was just over yesterday, actually, watching the, uh, the Arizona Cardinals game with me. So... Which was awesome. I'm surprised I have a voice left after that game. It was a good one. Yes, it was. You know, my wife would be awesome at Minecraft if she decided to play. She's an interior designer, and her eye for this kind of stuff and making everything look good would just be ridiculous. But she knows what would happen if she started playing this game. She would never get anything else done in life. Um, <laughs> she's kind of seen me go through that, so she knows better. And... Oh, chaos junk in the house. Hey, man, I was just watching a bit of your stream earlier. <laughs> look at, look at, I got this texture pack off of you. <laughs> your link. <laughs> Thanks for joining the stream tonight, man. Appreciate it. And what congratulations. He, uh, he, he got partnered with Twitch, it looked like. He's got the subscribe button on there. And uh, I know he's been working for that. So congratulations. I don't know when that happened, but uh, that's awesome, man. That's awesome. I'm going to hit that button soon, I promise. So what you're saying, though, Impulse, is that your wife would be the same way that you are with Minecraft. Yeah, I think so. I think so. If she, if she started playing, she would definitely get obsessive about it. And, and then you know what? The kids would get neglected. Next thing you know, CPS is at the door. <laughs> <laughs> you know? I don't think it would be a good thing. So I'm okay with her not playing. You know? I'm okay with it. Every once in a while, I have her come in and take a look at something I've been working on and say, hey, what is this? You know, how's this look to you? What can I do to improve it? You know, and she gives me that that kind of interior design eye for a minute. <laughs> Happened last week. Awesome. That that is so awesome, man. Chaos Chunk is a awesome Twitch streamer, guys. If you guys like watching stream streamers on Twitch, he he's great. He does it. I mean, so many nights of the week, he's he's hard at work on the streams. So check him out. You know, it's going to be worth the watch. Definitely. I tune in every once in a while when I can. Like I said, I got limited time, but I definitely check it out. Gets a lot done. He <laughs> gets a lot done. I told you how I hate forest biomes. <laughs> There's always one piece of wood you forget. Yeah. Yeah, you got to keep your eye on it as it decays. Yep. Oh, yep. I'm missing trees here. You're going to give me all the, the wood you're collecting too, right? Because I need yeah. it. Sweet. I don't <laughs> need it. Yeah, that's right. 
<laughs> uh, Chaos Chunk built my uh, Enderman farm on the, uh, I think it's the Build Guild server, right? That's the name of the server you're on? He built the uh, expander that I, I created a while back, and uh, from what I can tell, it's working good for you guys. So that is awesome. I appreciate you throwing down my design on your server. Definitely helped. I got some. I got a little pickup in subs there for a bit too, because you guys were dropping my name. So that was nice. I think uh, I got uh, some some messages too on that video that uh, you know Bacon sent sent me kind of things too. So. <laughs> uh, we tonight are working. Well, I think we're working on two different things tonight. Uh, McBean's working on his cathedral here. And I'm going to be working on a farm that I've been working on. Uh, there you go. Melon and pumpkin farm. And you know what? I'm going to turn the webcam on. Not tonight. It will be coming on. In fact, I'm just kind of working on my setup. Uh, I just switched to a desktop microphone. I was rocking the Logitech G35 headset. And I decided I was no longer comfortable wearing that thing for the many hours. You know, especially streaming. I didn't want to be on a webcam with a big old headset on. So I switched to a desktop mic. I'm actually using McBeans. Hey, that's the mic you're using? Yeah, this I, is your mic. How, you how do I sound? That. You this... sound great. The thing works for you. It doesn't work for me. <laughs> just, I guess it just likes you better. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Chaos, if, if you're having problems with the merge, man, I'd be happy to check it out. Just you know, shoot me a video or something and, and give me an idea. Or shoot me a mail. Let me know what's going on with it, and I'll see what I can do. Screenshots, whatever you want to do there. Ampulse, before you head over there, do you have any like oak wood? Oak wood. Uh, Just yeah. A I'm... little bit of that, sure. and I've got some more wood here for you as well. Okay, we'll make a good trade. There uh, we go. That's all. I got nineteen. Thirty-six and sixty-four. Fair trade. We get it. We solid. Yep. We're good. All right. All right. I'm getting back to work. That'll do. All right. Well, I'll come back later on in the stream and see how much I how have. Much, how much progress you've made tonight. Because <laughs> that's what happens. I will sit here and just stare at it for like five minutes and figure out, hmm, maybe a block here. I'm planning on running this stream for about, uh, let's say two and a half more hours or so. I do need to get some sleep because I know I'll be up late tomorrow. Oh, yeah. And up early the day after. Ah, it's locking out. So, are the uh, pistons leaving the blocks behind? Like they, sometimes I know if those pistons get a one tick pulse, they'll leave the blocks behind. And uh, I do have a way to reset that kind of with the next Enderman that falls that I had to put in after I published that video. So, hey, Final Spartan, how's it going? Good to see you, man. I do celebrate Christmas. I got three young ones this year, and they're really going to enjoy it, I think. My two year old, I can't wait to see her. This is yeah. kind of the first Christmas where she's going to be, you know, kind of understanding, not really understanding what it's about, but, you know, she'll enjoy opening presents. I'm sure, yeah, that, that's always the best. It, you know, when they're always young, it's always a good time when, yeah. you know, they're just enjoying it and they want to rip those presents open. Vibrator in the house. All right, hey, Chaos, stick around for a second, man. I'm going to head over to our Enderman farm and see if I can show you what I did here. Because I do, I do have a merge set up here as well, I think. So I will do that for you, man. I don't know why I closed that door. <laughs> I don't even know why there's a door in the nether hub. <laughs> hmm. All right, where am I going? Where am I going? Let's see if there's any uh, mine carts left. Oh, I did say I wanted to grab some food as well. Oh, you know what? I'll get some food when I get there. I'll get some food oh, yeah, when I get there. Yeah, there's plenty of food there. Yep. Yeah, we, we definitely moderators. If you got to kick that guy, go ahead. <laughs> you know what? I didn't get a chance. I saw you, Chaos, that you were kind of in creative working on something with a, it looked like a, a drop of Vader or something, but I was kind of kind of in and out. I was kind of just lurking in your stream. And uh, no, I didn't pay too much attention, man. I don't judge. <laughs> I have my moments with Redstone, too. For sure, I'm. I'm not a genius like most of the zip crowd guys are. But I, I can do enough to, enough to be dangerous, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Mom makes you crazy with presents. Is that because she's getting you all stuff you didn't ask for? Or because... <laughs> I'm guessing I'm guessing that's the answer. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I definitely gotta do something about this this track here. <laughs> Whoa. I'll just leave that cart love. there. Yeah. Alright, Enderman Farm. We should be close to the merge. Yeah. Let me see if I can figure out a way to get to it. Uh huh. This is gonna be hard to get up in here, but I'll do my best. Oh yeah, one thing I did add on later was I actually have a couple spots on the side for these guys to spawn too. Um, which I thought was a pretty cool addition. Let me see here. I thought I had a... Here we go. I have an access ladder here. Let's see if I can get in and take a look at this merge. Alright, so you can see there's the vines growing down. And here's the pistons pushing these guys over right here and maybe I didn't do it oh you know what I did I did <laughs> I did it differently I did the strings across the, the sides on this one is what I did because it's connected to both of these bad boys that's what I did okay sorry this isn't gonna help you because I got a dual expender here and basically what I did was when these pistons push out if this one happens to lose its block this tripwire goes all the way across to this other side, so if a guy falls down on this other side, he's just gonna trigger the piston on both sides and he'll grab the block. So that didn't that didn't help. But typically, uh, you know, what I do for the expander is I run another string right across this way, the way I'm looking, and then I connect that redstone up to the one that goes across the top. It's Bud! Yes. Bud, I'm so sorry, I forgot how to say your last name. Is it Gillet? I know Skizzleman likes to call you Bud Jelay. But yeah, so if you if you run a string across right here, basically what happens is even if they lose their block here, the, if they fall down on this side, oh, I made one angry. <laughs> if they fall down on this side, then they'll re-trigger all of them, and then they'll get it. Awesome, awesome. Cool, man. Hope that helps. If you still have any issues, just let me know, man. I'll be happy to help you get it figured out. <sighs> Let's see. Oh, look at that! You even sent some people to my stream. That just all that all that help just paid off. <laughs> oh, nice! That worked out too. Back where I needed to be. And you know what? I forgot. Guess what? I forgot, McBean. What's up? I forgot to grab the food, man. You keep forgetting. That you keep mentioning it though. So like, you know, you're I'm gonna, gonna wait food. till I'm starving. I have 19 chicken left. You know what? I'm gonna roll with it. We'll see how much. That's plenty of chicken. I got watermelon, but I hate wait. I hate eating watermelon, because it's like it, it only replenishes one. So by the time I notice I'm hungry, I gotta eat like five of them. <laughs> you know, and you just spend it like five minutes eating. So no, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Go to spawn and get yourself some pumpkin pie. Yeah. SMB Super Minecraft Brothers. Uh, that's Ooh. what it is right now. <laughs> we need a theme song for that. Yeah, yeah. Like make up a theme song. If yeah. anybody's good at making up theme songs, that'd be great. Iron foundries are fun. Yeah, we got an iron trench on this server, so uh, we built that, and then the iron foundry came out right after that, of course. Of course, I, I knew Tango was working on it. <laughs> Ooh, Faction. Tell me more about Faction. I've heard about Faction. Is this? I, I think Faction is... From what I understand, is it more of like a, it's one of those systems where you have like money, right? Currency is involved, something like that. Ooh, vanilla pumpkin pie factory. So chaos, this is this is close then, what we're doing. Um, hello, doors, stay open. Um, I got the, the sugar cane farm here. I got a melon farm down there in the middle of it. And I got a pumpkin farm, although you can't see it because I'm working on the layer. This is a good pumpkin one right in the middle. And uh, and then I got a witch farm right there. So all I'm going to need now is like a chicken slash egg farm. And I will have all the ingredients I need for uh, pumpkin pie. <laughs> so that'll be cool. All right, I'm going to make some pistons. I've been... I've been... Trying to make these pistons for I <laughs> know, man. That and getting food. Yeah, yeah. Our SMB streams are going to be a Tuesday night affair. Of course, with the holidays, we moved it up to Monday nights. So this this week and next week will be Monday nights, um, and then after that, back to Tuesday nights. So be sure to uh, whoa, hello, whoa, 
Hello, little fella. Where'd you go? Oh, two of them. I got two little zombies chasing me. They they both have spoons. Ooh, no, just good. one has a spoon. I can't tell he's on. I can't tell he's on fire. Uh oh, they're saying the video froze. Okay, let's see. Let's see. I gotta check it out. Go to my dashboard. No, I'm seeing it. Let me know if it doesn't unfreeze for you, because on my dashboard it's running. Yeah, it looked like it to me too, and I just saw that comment, so it looks good to me. Okay. All right. Ooh, drank is dank. Thank you. <laughs> what? Drank is dank is here. Good buddy of mine. Hopefully, hopefully he's got the uh, yeah the moderator status. You know what? He doesn't. Oh man. Drank, I don't know how I how I missed you, man. Drank is dank. Yep. There you go. Okay. I'm still making pistons. You know what? I was trying to make my pistons, and guess what? I got attacked, man. Hey, thanks, bud. You too. No, we actually have a uh, iron trench on the server. So we, we do need to hook up at least the chunk loading part of the foundry so that it doesn't rebuild all the time. But let's see what else I need. Uh, actually, right now I'm good with the number of mods I have, so... If I lose some mods, maybe I'll, I'll consider getting you in there. Do... Item duplicator. Uh, yeah, the sand duplicator and portal. Uh, should you make it? Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 wait. I read that wrong. Sorry. Let me look at that again. I just designed an item duplicator using the end portal. Should I make a video on it? Um... Yeah, I mean, there's other ways to duplicate items. I think they're still using hoppers and loaded chunks in the nether, something like that. Uh, you know, I don't use item duplicators. I do videos on them every once in a while, but I don't use them. <laughs> and, uh, I mean, it wouldn't hurt. If you got a YouTube channel, item, item duplicators are usually pretty popular on YouTube. So, two, three, four... I did see the one where people were duplicating sand, but setting that kind of system up on a, any world would be an, uh, a nightmare. <laughs> you know what are not that good of videos on YouTube? Our building videos. Especially mine, because they're just so slow. And it's very boring. My daughters watch me play, and they just like... They tell you you're boring? <laughs> How can you do what you're doing? <laughs> For me, it's soothing. It's, you know, it's just whatever. I'm just placing, like right now, I'm just placing blocks right now. Yeah. Nothing to it. Oh, Drank is going to say something. What does he say? Never cheats. Never cheats. Nope. Actually, I don't know, unless, you know, one of the other guys has on this server. I don't think we've duplicated any items on the server. I, I of course, found duplication glitches and stuff but he cheats at basketball but hey it's another story <laughs> oh yeah yeah that's true i could see that because you're gonna get you're gonna get your um no oh, here we go where's my mods at where you're gonna get your chickens right from the chicken jockeys i mean they they're not gonna produce that much i'd assume but if you afk there long enough they're gonna not despawn and I actually have to deal with that with my my gold farm. I got to figure out a way to get all them all them chickens out of my gold farm from the pigmen. The zombie pigmen are spawning on them. Little, little pigmen jockeys. Uh, how many pistons am I gonna make? <laughs> and of course, I can't decide what to throw down. Uh, 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 uh. I need more iron, of course. It's going to be a while before I get used to this texture pack. I'm like looking around for stuff. I have no idea where it is. It's cool though. So far I'm really liking it. There we go. And that's enough pistons for now. Now all I need is a place to store my junk. <laughs> that's all I ever seem to carry. More storage. Yeah, we'll get rid of some of this wood. That's what we need. Yeah, I mean, if you're playing vanilla, duplicating items, you know, you might as well just play creative. I mean, I understand if you're on a server 
right? And, and you feel like you need to duplicate items to profit somehow on a, on a public server or something. I understand why people do it, but I mean, that just, you're right. It takes the fun out of the game. Cheating always takes the fun out of the game, if you ask me. Before I go down there, I'm gonna go down there anyway, but I bet you anything, I don't have half of what I need. Hopefully I got some iron blocks down here. We do have a shortage of that. Awesome peeps, one, two, three, what's up? What's happening? Perfect iron villager. Uh, no. No, we have a combination of a librarian that has the paper in the last trade and a blacksmith who has, <laughs> he has a uh, iron, or uh, what's he got? He's got uh, a diamond sword. What you laughing at, McBean? Drank. Oh, what is Drank saying? I, I'm having a hard time keeping up here. Oh, man. Right there. Right there. <laughs> Slug <laughs> Wolf, what's happening? <laughs> Drank's got jokes. Yep. I'm going to run out of stuff for sure, but this is going to be the hardest part, getting up and down oh, from this thing. That is no bueno. Let's see what happens. Kyle Crad, how's it going? Uh, Overcast Network. Let's see. Overcast Network. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I've played on the Overcast Network. Um... I'm guessing that's kind of like a mini games PvP server. I, not quite sure. I've been That'd on a be few a different servers, but yeah, I, I, I seriously doubt it. I, I don't do a lot of PvP or playing on other servers. Pretty much SMB, Zip Crowd, my future craft LP. Inventing stuff, which I haven't done in a while. You know, actually, I lied. I invented something on Saturday. Just for this server. I invented a uh, armor uh, and item equipper. You know, it's supposed to be that when, when Roby1 dies on the server and he needs to get back to his stuff before it despawns, <laughs> that he'd be able to basically walk into a booth and it would give him his armor, like just shoot it onto him, you know? And it'd shoot a bunch of ender pearls and a bunch of food so that he could have a bunch of stuff in his inventory. You know, your basic gear, right? Just enough to get back to your stuff before it despawns without risking death again. Where's and that at? I, I created it on creative, on a creative server. I was about to do a video on it. Um, and then I ran out of time. And the next day, Seth Bling <laughs> did the same exact thing. He published a video on the, the Minecraft server with the same exact thing. And after that, I was like, mm, well, there goes that. <laughs> no point in me doing it now. Oh, if it's easy it? to build, we still need one for Roby. Oh, you know what? I'm doing this wrong. I have a degree in CIS. Didn't go for the hardcore uh, computer science major, but I do. Mobbing Minecraft's on board, too. Oh, nice. Nice. What's up, Mobbing? It's been a while, man. I haven't seen you in a while. He's I He's missed... playing strong. Yeah. He's playing strong. Check his channel out. Nice. Yeah, Seth Bling, same exact thing. Of course, you know what? His is pretty good. I'll give it to him. His is pretty good. There are some things about mine I liked a little better. I like the footprint of mine a little better. Um, but he had a couple extra dispensers, which was nice. Um, so I'll give it to him. It's Seth Bling, man. You can't, <laughs> you can't beat Seth Bling. <laughs> Seth Bling was actually a really cool guy. I talked to him at uh, Minecon, at the Minecraft party. Got a chance to kind of just... He was just kind of hanging out in the stairwell <laughs> at, at the bowling alley, and we just kind of, Tango Tech and I just kind of hung out talking to him for a while. Good good while. I was late. He was exhausted. We're actually, uh, this isn't the Zip Crowd server tonight. This is the SMB server. So SMB is, is basically me and some really good friends of mine. Oh, Zip Crowd. <laughs> yeah, okay. That's what he's saying hello to ZipCrowd for. Because ZipCrowd's in Twitch. Twitch I'm is slow. Up. Trying to keep up with chat and build this beast. <laughs> Don't mind me. Nothing to see here. I'm just going to keep on building. How's the, uh, the music to voice ratio as far as sound goes? You guys, I know last week the music was kind of low. You guys couldn't really hear it. Um, I wanted it to be a nice mix this time. 
Hey, for myself, I tell you, I love it because I couldn't hear it last time at all, so I can finally hear it. Oh, cool. Awesome, Kitty. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. <laughs> perfect. Is that perfect? Okay. Good thing I got jump boost. This would have been a pain. The <laughs> redstone does is tripping me out on this texture pack, too. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, you know what? The music playing tonight, I know you guys can see it across the top of the screen. It's Blackmail. Um, I actually downloaded Blackmail's albums from iTunes today. I paid the money for them because Blackmail, I love it. I'm probably going to get the whole content ID match in YouTube when I post the, the stream back to YouTube because a lot of people have asked me to do that and you know what if they match me for content I don't care they can have it um, especially if it's the money's going to blackmail you know if it's going to some other random person claiming they own blackmail's music then I'll be mad but uh, if he wants to get the money off my video views it's fine I'm okay with it this time I like listening to blackmail glad you're such a generous person <laughs> yeah man you know, I really didn't. I really didn't plan on posting the uh, live streams to YouTube anyway. And really, the only reason I'm doing it is because there's a lot of people that have told me, "Hey, you guys, just this is a bad time. You guys stream at night, you know, in your time, and it's like for Europeans, it's kind of crazy, middle of the night type of thing, and there's just no way they'd be able to, to get in here live. So they want to still be able to see the streams, which I think is pretty cool that they'd want to still join us in one way or another." Speed is high. Oh, you know what? I gotta do. I gotta take this torch tower. I'm trying. I'm trying to decode what you're saying there, vibe. <laughs> I don't know if I want to decode it though. I know you're 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 speaking in code, man. <laughs> Some type of code. I'm kind of curious if we're gonna have any uh, any other SMB guys join us. I know Skizzle Man said he was gonna try to join us. I didn't hear from Roby. Did you hear anything back from him? I uh, didn't hear anything from Roby One. I know Fallen is at some sort of LAN party, which is cool. It's cool. Oh man, <laughs> I gotta go. <sighs> I'll be doing this all night. I was hoping I'd have some time to get... I may just have to take a break from this if I get bored of doing it. Or people get bored of watching, which I wouldn't blame them. But uh, I did want to get a storage system going so I, I could actually turn this farm on. Yeah, okay, my upload speed. Um, what is it? I just tested it not too long ago because I was, I was trying to make a decision on uh, internet service providers. And so I was kind of comparing... It. Uh, Cox, who I had, and, Qu and Quest, CenturyLink they are now, whatever. And it turns out that Cox had a better speed. I think it was at like 24 up for me. And Quest could only, or, I just said it again, CenturyLink could only get it to uh, like 14, or something like that. So, but I won't complain, 24 for up speed. Can't complain with that. Yeah, that's good. I'm just building this torch tower all the way up. I don't even care. I don't even care. I'm just gonna go all the way to the top. Man. <laughs> you know what? If Chaos banned you, I'm sure he had a reason. Maybe you can talk him into, if he's still around, maybe you can talk him into unbanning you. You gotta ask him nicely, I'm sure. <laughs> Am I to the top yet? Woo! No, that's the other thing. I was at the Enderman farm. I could have at least enchanted something. I've been carrying that's 35 right XP. That's that exact same thing. Enchanting my pick. Enchanting my shovel. <laughs> I 
Yeah, there's enough trolls on the internet these days, that's for sure. Ding, ding. Oh man, I almost fell. <laughs> 4K quality. <laughs> uh, people have actually tried to talk me out of doing 1080p. They said, what? There's, there's no, there's, you know, there's no reason why I should upload in 1080p. And what do you mean? There's no reason. Why? Why not? I mean, I mean, the only reason to not do it is because it takes so long. All right. So. But I don't care, you know. I I upload, I go to sleep as I'm uploading, so it doesn't bother me. Uh, torches. Well, I'm up here. See, I'm gonna start breaking the glass because <laughs> I don't want to go all the way down and then come all the way back up. So yeah, let's see here. Where's the house? Boo! That worked. Now I'm gonna forget that I broke that hole and fall. <laughs> Torches and iron blocks. That's what I need right now. That's all I'm doing. Torches and iron blocks. Yeah, the music is nice. Yeah, I like watching my stuff in 1080p. I mean, my... my obviously, my internet can handle it. It's no big deal there. And then, you know, if... If somebody's watching on like a big screen or something, which you can do, you know, with all these smart devices now, the what is that? Uh, Google just Chrome, the Chrome thing, is that what it's called? Chrome, Chrome key or something? What is it called? McBean, you know, you know this. For what? The little thing you plug into your TV, HDMI port, and you can actually watch like YouTube videos and. Yeah, and I've seen the commercials. I don't remember what it's called, but yeah, the little Chrome. Yeah, so looks I'm like a little USB key thing. I'm assuming there's gonna be a lot of people that are watching YouTube on like big screen TVs now. And oh, that's true. I could have. Chromecast. Chromecast. See, I was close. Ah. Uh. Awesome. Thanks for subscribing to the YouTube channel. Appreciate that. I would really love to get to 10,000 subscribers soon. <laughs> I've been watching the numbers. Not going up very, very fast, but it's going up slowly but steadily. I'll subscribe and resubscribe so the numbers help out. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. Skythe. Did I say that right? Somebody wanted me to say Skythe. It's his name. Skythe MC. Hopefully I said that right. Or skiff. Appreciate you joining the stream tonight. And oh man. I hope that trench is running. Because I'm gonna run out of iron blocks. Oh, that was a witch farm. That was a witch farm. You seen it. You know what? I appreciate the offer, but I am just so busy. It I wish I could play with every single person. It's asked me. I honestly do. I would. Uh -uh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Go make more alternate accounts. Exactly. <laughs> That's awesome. Is that how you do it? Okay. Yeah, oh, man. I love having hundred. subscribers. I do, but I, I love I love the view the view count going up too. It's nice. When your view can look at that, I just made this torch tower. Like, hope I didn't miss any torches, man. I made a torch tower all the way to the top. Ooh, what is this song? I haven't heard this song. Huh. We have been throwing around an idea that we'll probably do in future streams. I don't know, McBean, if you were in on this, but. Um, and we're not going to do it this week, obviously, with a lot of the guys not here. But we were thinking uh, one of these nights with the SMB stream, actually getting off the SMB server and going into like a public, you know, like a high pixel maybe PvP, and then basically anybody that's in stream Ooh. with us, you know, we could try to get in a match together. That you know, like obviously, a good idea. it'd be it'd be hit or miss if everyone had to click the same sign and stuff like that. There'd be a lot of a lot of people missing out, but. You'd get a chance at least to come. Then I could you know. have a whole bunch of people just make fun of me when I lose first. <laughs> yeah. Well, they wouldn't have to make fun of you because they would be killing you. Exactly. There's a lot of trash talking, and I'd be the brunt of it. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, that'd be pretty cool, man. To get a 
face some people that are chilling in these live streams every week. Plus, Let's I need to practice see. my PvP. I stink at it. Yeah. Have you gotten what is it? Their <laughs> uh, their MVP account? No, I haven't gotten the, you gotta the, make sure the you high get pixel VIP or whatever it is. Yeah. VIP. There you go. Yeah, see, people are hyping on that idea. They want to come, come give a kill us, basically. Yeah, exactly. That's what it is. <laughs> I want a chance to kill you. It's a, a narcissistic thing to do. <laughs> what version is the server on? Uh, we should be on one seven four. Yep, one seven four. It's uh, it's part of the reason why I started getting into Twitch, of course, because the integrated thing. But then I found out pretty quickly that the in-game live streaming was you know fairly limited compared to what you can do in open broadcaster i like having song titles and a reminder to subscribe on youtube <laughs> that always comes in handy and then of course i'm gonna throw in the webcam someday i will i haven't been hiding my face i put a vlog out there it was terrible um pretty scary the, the quality on the vlog was terrible i've been trying to upgrade some equipment so that i can get a better webcam working on the desktop microphone my fantasy team winning tonight should help mm -hmm. me with some, some money to get a, a better mic. So I'm just testing out McBean's microphone right now. And it's it's good. It's good. But um, it, it feels a little bassy to me. I don't know what it sounds like to sounds you guys. Sounds good to but me. I mean, I don't know. It sounds like you got a nice full voice. Yeah? All right. Well, I'm sure, I'm sure now that you see... Are you here? How, how good it sounds. You might want it back. <laughs> nah, that's all right. Uh, that you know what I do okay. like though. I like the uh, the stand and stuff. Well, yeah, you, listen, that that microphone has been at the office for I mean <laughs> a couple of years, right? I just had it up on my shelf for a while, just there, so people thought that I was like a professional speaker. You know, I was trying to impos impersonate somebody. <laughs> I, I, was, I feel was like a professional. The, underneath my desk. Side, side. Did I get that right? I can't even I can't even say it with the right phonetics on the screen, man. I'm sorry. I'm the worst at not only <laughs> not only p pronouncing names, but I won't remember your name either. I'm like the worst at remembering people's names. I could know somebody for like ten years. I see him in the hallway, and I'm just like, "Sup, man?" <laughs> and they just know that I forgot their name. That works out for, for the SMB guys, though, that I forget their names because then I don't accidentally call them by their, their real name and stream. Yeah, that's happened a few times <laughs> on older. That's another thing. You know, I don't really care that much. I'm not just going to give it out, but if it does come out what my name is, I mean, it's not like it. it's a big deal to me. You know, it's just like, at what point is it, okay, now you have way too much information about me that it becomes a problem. You know, I don't I'll know. be selling his social security card next week. <laughs> yeah, no kidding, man. Look at that and everything else. His address. No, I've never played uh, with Mumbo. Although, I can tell you, man, he is one of the hottest YouTubers out there right now. He's, his channel is just growing like crazy. He invents so many things that are just so handy. It's ridiculous. I don't know where he, he comes up with these ideas. It would be nice. It'd be nice. I wouldn't mind jumping on the Hermitcraft server. <laughs> it's not like I, I don't have enough servers that I'm part of already, right? Servers are the best, though. I mean, I really love the interaction, the, the group building. It's just more. It's more fun to be around people than, you know. I like my single player world because it kind of gives me some unwind time, but it's just more fun to be social, I think. And servers kind of give you that. As I stack jump torch tower for the last 20 minutes, <laughs> let's keep the conversation moving. Because that's about all we got right now. <laughs> Alright, I think I got that to the same level. And hopefully I have enough to get one more. I bet you I run out of sticks before I get it, but oh well. Let's get on down there. Get on down. 
I'm excited to see this farm. You know what? I actually tested the speed of the sugarcane farm tonight. And it's basically producing a stack of sugarcane uh, per level per hour. Does that make sense? So there's 18 levels of sugarcane. And there's 18 stacks of sugarcane after an hour. So. Yeah, definitely. I gotta tell you though, I haven't been in my future craft world in a while. And I do miss it. So, you know, you, you kind of get to that point, right? Like, we were away from SMB for a while. Just people had so much stuff going on. And when we got back on the server, it's it was like the only thing I wanted to do for a while. I, I wanted to just, I mean, obviously, look at this big old farm I built. <laughs> I got some time in, you know. I love the fact that, that we got the guys back together. We're all... Working on stunt stuff together the, the again. The band's back the together. The band's back together. I know. I'm waiting on Future Craft, too. <laughs> I just have not had time. Future Craft is one of those things I do where I literally put in probably, I don't know how many hours. Anywhere between, like, 20 and 40 hours. Like, maybe 40 is too much. Twenty. Let's say 20 hours per episode. And... It's just, you know, it's hard to find that kind of time, especially right now with all the stuff I got going on. SMB is nice. I, I can just jump on here, especially with the live streams. You know, I can jump on here and actually get work done um, while <laughs> I'm getting, getting you know, kind of content, kind of getting out in front of you guys and, and reconnecting with the, you know, the viewers. It's all about you guys. I can't wait till we start up this PvP thing. I think we should do that not next week, but maybe the week after. I'm gonna suggest that. Whatever. Yeah, yeah those long hours definitely do pay off because the quality of the Future Craft episodes, I think, definitely shine through there. It's just it's it's a lot of work. It's grueling. LPs LPs in general are one of the harder things you can do on YouTube. Especially if you spend the time, you know, you don't just hit record and go. You plan it. You, well, music is hiccuping. Did you hear that? Uh, you know, you plan it out. You do a bunch of video editing. The builds that I typically do in my future craft world are usually, you know, like this. Ginormous. <laughs> so, always takes a while. That's a lot of torches. Why not half slabs? If I did, uh, if I did half slabs and bringing the redstone up that way, a couple of things. It would run out of signal strength, first of all. And second of all, I need these two uh, trigger pistons all the way up. And the way I have it going, it's just it, it's going to be better this way. So, um, okay, so that does it for the tower, this torch tower part. I think that was probably a, the right move to do. Just build the torch tower up first, and then I'll kind of now be able to start building these layers here. Except I'll be running out of material, of course. <laughs> a little bit. A little bit tall. <laughs> My biggest problem after building this farm is that I will run out of storage space to store it all. And then I'm going to wish it was smaller. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you did name the hive. That, that was a great name. And you know what? That mob farm is ridiculous. That is the fastest hostile mob farm I've ever built. The biggest thing I've built, oh man. Probably the biggest thing I built wasn't even a build. It was it was uh, when I dug out my spawn chunks on Future Craft. <laughs> I dug out my entire spawn region down to level 60 and there was like mountains and stuff that I dug. Um, that was like the biggest project I guess I've ever worked on. As far as builds, uh, the double Enderman farm here on the SMB server was definitely a pretty big build. Took me a while. I think it took me a couple weekends to do where I pretty much played all day long <laughs> for two weekends in a row. And I had to flood the end island. That was that was fun. Yeah. I'm glad I did it. You know, I like having the Enderman farm right next to the Wait, I the, think that's I think platform. that's your biggest build is that though. Yeah, I mean the fact that it's a double expender. 
<laughs> well, wait. How about the? Well, you didn't do the. Uh, it was uh, Fallen and Cast who did the the trench, oh, right? Oh, the trench. I did the trench in my let, my Let's Play though. That's huge. That was huge. That was a massive project, but I got it done in one night. It was just a really really long night. <laughs> That's crazy. So. I missed a water block, did I? Oh, thank you. See? The, pow the, the power of the stream. Nice. I'll let that melt. I really appreciate that. Nothing worse than having to go through a build like that. <laughs> try to figure out what you did wrong. I had a little bit of that happening with my uh, sugarcane farm. That's why I very rarely do redstone. Yeah, I had I had a whole like s couple sections at the top that just they weren't they weren't going off when the the timer went off, and uh, I found out that what happened was some water had oops some water had come down and washed out some redstone, it like in the middle of the thing, <laughs> and so I had to find out which layer it was on. Oops, I guess I want to probably plant something there. <laughs> yes, yes, MC edit and large survival builds kind of defeat survival. <laughs> yes. You might as well just play creative and use MC edit altogether, I think. I mean, for me, vanilla survival is, is for me, why I play Minecraft. You know, I try to find ways to max survival out. And we're having questions. COD or BF4? I haven't played BF4 yet. Just because I play Minecraft too much. <laughs> um, but I am typically a Battlefield series fan versus the Call of Duty stuff. I tried Call of Duty and it was just, it seemed chaotic. Like there was no really strategies. It's just people running around shooting each other and dying, you know. You try to just kill someone before you got killed, basically. And, and it Impulse, was just chaos. Like he is with Minecraft, was an excellent <laughs> Battlefield player. Oh, and and we, we started off at Battlefield. Yep. Actually, Battle Battlefield 2. Two. Yep, Battlefield 2 Battlefield was our game. Two. I got us hooked on that one. Oh, hey. Oh, it doesn't have water, that's why. And, uh, yeah, too bad they didn't have, like, Twitch back then for that. I'm sure you can do it now with the Battlefield 4 and Call of Duty, but... There were some secret recordings on that. Oh Bullshit yeah, and bullets. I I had uh, I put a video out at one point in time, not on the Impulse channel, but a different channel that I used to have, and it was a uh, like a no scope sniper shot on a pilot or something crazy. It was it was a good one. I gotta break this ice here. It's bugging me. Next time I'm gonna do it before I place the glowstone. There we go. Alright, how am I doing? <laughs> uh, losing track.